Hello there. Today I'm gonna show you the scatter cattle uh, stick mark two, the NeoPixel version, and you can tell it's NeoPixel by checking in here. There's these uh, pixel pins. I'll just see if I can get the light in here. So you can see there's these pixel pins in there. It's not an actual lamp down here. Okay. And as you can tell, because the near pixel light. It is not hollow. It's got this um, connector here, metal connector. And all the other blade is um, made up of little pixels. And when I light up, you can tell because it's a lot brighter and better quality. And also, the individual pixels can light up or turn off. Um, and it comes with a um, USB um, a micro SD card reader, micro SD card reader, um, Allen key for installing. Uh, installing the blade there, so the blade just goes in here, like that, and then you can just tighten it with with the Allen keys, uh, with the screws and Allen keys on these two holes here. Um, it comes with a charging cable, and comes with a manual as well. So let's fire it up and check it out. Um, actually, before I do that. It also comes with, um, this comes with a uh, Bluetooth connectivity where you can download the uh, Xano configura Configurator um, app from the Apple App Store or the Google App Store or Google Play Store. Um, yeah, and check out, we got instructions on that as well at lightningstick.com.au. Um, and once you download the uh, app, you can control it using your mobile phone like you can basically ch change the color um, of the blade um, change the visual effects change the scent fonts of the blade with your mobile phone and turn it on and off of your mobile phone so this is already on standby so I've just got to tap and that fires it up as you can see it's smooth swing tap it once Tapping on one is blast effect, and then if you tap and hold, um, then you would turn this, turn it off, and then while it's, uh, while it's on standby mode, um, tap and hold. There you go. While it's turned on, tap and hold for two flashes. You can see the flash here, and that would change the color of the blade. It just keeps rotating until you press the button again to select the color you want. So I'm going to rotate to purple and then tap. That's selected, but because I'm not sure you heard much of that because it's really loud, but also you can mute it and you can also. Um, Turn the volume lower or higher as well. Um, so that, sorry, that was really loud. I was trying to say that while the blades turn on, you can press and hold, wait for two flashes here, and um, let go. Then the color of the blade would change. So that's what you saw there. Um, and to select a different scent point, press and hold and wait for two flash. Broken ignition. That's a different um, blade um, ignition type. It's broken ignition. Let's check it out. So to get on standby mode, you saw, saw I done that is press and hold for about three flashes. Now while it's turned on standby mode, you press and hold for three flashes on this thing. That would take change the um, different blade type, like it's like a scent font type. Broken ignition. So that's I think that was more of the blade um, ignition type. 
Well, let's try again. Broken ignition. Um, so press and hold two. Candy blade. Okay, sorry, my mistake. That was um, so you to change the blade type is press and hold for two flashes. If you press and hold for three flashes, that would um, change the ignition type. So that was the that was the candy blade. Cracked blade. So there's there's many many other um, blade types and many ignition types. Um, Thirty two different sand fonts. So I uh, won't go through them all here. But yeah, thanks for watching.